Hi traders, this is Forex Nelson, back doing another uh, two trades. This time I'm trading outside of the blue box. Just want to show you that you can trade outside of the blue box and normally trade within the blue box. Today's date is December the 11th. Took the trade actually around 12.22 and 12.26. Did the pound Aussie and the pound yen. I put a line exactly where I got in, at the pound Aussie, this line, I took the trade as it was hooking around, following my uh, pip trigger rules, got in here, it did go against me 15 pips, there's my 20 pip stop, and I'm up right now 25 pips, and on the pound yen, I got in right on this red candle as it was going down. Everything was telling me to sell. Now it did go against me about 15 pips. There's my 20 pip stop. And I'm up 13 pips right now. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to close the trade as it's starting to go against me. I just finally closed all my trades. I did a grand total of four trades today as you can see down at the bottom. Uh, three out of the four were outside of the blue box and I was only scalping three are scalping and the other one is a little bit more than just scalping but anyhow on the pound Swiss this one right here I took the trade right at this cursor it went against me 10 pips never did hit my 20 pip stop and I ended up getting seven pips on that one and what I like about the pip trigger is I can get the timing pretty close where it doesn't go very much against me and it's great for scalping in other words say three to ten pips and or if you want to get ten or twenty pips so it just depends on how you want to trade so let's check the uh, pound Aussie. This one I got the most amount. It, again, it was during lunchtime. Got in around 12.20 New York time, right where this cursor is. Now this one came close to my stop, which is 20 pips there. But it, it went 15 pips, so it still never hit my stop. And I ended up getting 22 or 23 pips. That's the larger amount down here at the bottom, over 1,600. And then, of course, the pound yen. Another one I took during lunchtime today. So you traders who want to just make some money while you're on your lunch, it's quite easily done with the pip trigger. You don't even need the meter, but the meter at the time uh, let's see, the meat was showing that the pound was weak, so that's why I focused mostly on the pound, but I threw in the uh, euro because it's also weak. So going back to the pound, so anytime it does a pullback and then I get a reversal, I take the trade, there's your pullback. I was a little bit late getting in on this one, but I knew it was going to come down and test the bottom here. So I knew a 20 pip stop would hold. There's my 20 pip stop. It was only 15 pips again. And I just close it out at 10 pips. Like I said, you know, you can do 5 or 10 trades and get 3 to 10 pips and get the multiple standard lots you can make totals like this down here and of course for the Euro Aussie that's the only one I did within the box I saw that it was going down in the downtrend I was a little bit impatient I just jumped in here but it did go against me but not too much it only went against me like 12 pips never did hit my 20 pip stop which is right here and I finally decided to close out over here with seven pips 
I learned that from another trader and just scalping and he uses the pip trigger and he does 10 to 20 trades a day and with the pip trigger you'll get a hundred trades a day if you scan everything on the left side which is what I do is I just scan check on the 30 minutes the one hour make sure everything is I'm going in the direction of the trend and by the way I teach that in the training videos and then it's the meter I use to tell me which one I should be focusing on and I do teach all that in the training videos along with many examples so if you're interested in a pip trigger you can certainly uh, look right below this video and you can get all my contact information you can either Skype me email me or if you live close enough you can call directly to my cell phone and by the way just for a few hours work today this turned into a, a total of more than thirty eight hundred dollars some traders made some comments that they want me to go in more detail They're showing exactly how I do this uh, on the YouTube I don't want to go in too much detail because then um, you probably will not be interested in buying the pip trigger but if you're if you're really interested in the pip trigger I do teach with well over 300 videos there's 342 videos uh, in great detail showing exactly how I scan the market and uh, what I'm looking for and how to get in the trade and how to manage the trade and things like that so anyhow that just about wraps up this uh, tra trading day of mine and um, if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to my YouTube channel so until the next trade happy trading